close your eyes and concentrate in your breathing. Take a deep breath. As I picture myself surrounding, surrounded by a deep, dark space without stars, any light, nothing, just myself levitating in the void. In the previous moment, before dreaming, And so, I start to dream in this dark space, start to design the most beautiful place you could ever imagine. The place of your dreams. Take a deep breath. And there. In the best place you could imagine, you can picture a house, a beautiful house, and you recognize it's your home, the home of your soul. the house, watching every corner of it, designing, imagining each part of it.
and when I find myself ready, I get inside the house. As I open the door, I see inside of it the entire universe. The stars, the planets, all the history, all the beings that I can imagine in every dimension, I find inside. My dreams came true. And I dare to get inside this house. As I get inside this cosmos within my house, I see levitating all the things in a chaotic order. The people I love, the objects I am attached to, my pets, plants, masters, guides, aliens, all the beings that I can feel as a part of me. As I picture myself in the middle, in the center, I can perceive how all of them, all of it, is part of me, that I am everything. All of it is connected to me. All of them are part of this dream my dream. I recognize that all of it exists only because I feel love when I think about it. It's because of the love that I feel that this dream is real. And I sing to all of them, recognizing that all of them are connected to me by love, that I am the universal love. I am 
universal love. I am universal love. I am universal love. Imagine that this wide space, open space, is your mind, empty, and yourself, myself, is the consciousness that designed the patterns of my thoughts. Take a deep breath and try to connect to remember all the illusions that you had in your life when you were a child, a teenager, an adult, and a mature person. Take a deep breath. And every memory of imagination, of illusion that you had as a child, make it now as a step. It doesn't matter the direction, but each memory of each illusion is one step in this space, creating a pattern in your path. What are the illusions that you had as a child and you left behind? What are the illusions that you had as a child and you still hold today? Think about the illusions that you had as a teenager. The people you fell in love with. The idols that you had. The illusions that you had onto other people. And each time you remember one, Give a new step in any direction, designing the pattern. Take a deep breath, and when you're ready, keep walking around, remembering the illusions of being an adult and a mature person.
I look around, watching how my path starts to reproduce in much lines many others, creating the signs, drawings. I observe myself surrounded by the drawings of my illusions. I allow my imagination to show me the patterns, the drawings that my illusions have designed for me. Without judgment, I allow myself to imagine. Take a deep breath and watch the entire plane that designed what you are, the drawing that makes you be. I observe how each path, each step that I gave in my life with illusions are made of love and they were conditioned so as, so as I look the entire picture I set every step free making it all into unconditional love Take a deep breath. Unconditional love. I start to use my imagination to bring back all the things that I am attached to, physical things of my life not only now, but since I was a child. All the objects from home, toys, games, clothes, art, electronic devices, books, pictures,
and I recognize this, that this attachment is not negative. This is the link of love that I feel or felt for each one of them. I take all these objects I feel love for. I feel good memories of them and I put them all inside the house of my dreams, the place where I feel at home. Imagine that house filled up with all these things. And I see with my imagination how this huge black space turns into this beautiful sizing the place of my dreams. I walk around the house and joining the space, touching every object, watching every color, smelling, feeling the touch. I feel all the sensations, all the feelings, emotions that produce my senses. As I touch and feel every object, I recognize that all of it, every tree, every wall, every object that I am touching are made of the unconditional love of the universe, but just it has been limited in different shapes. But even though they are still love, I get out of the house now and I start to see all the sightings changing trees, mountains, cities. I think about every person, family, friend, the population, cars roads, buildings, houses. I see also the garbage, the fightings, the war. I see all the things equally, taking a deep breath, remembering that all those objects, all the things of the world, our unconditional love, fractalized in many shapes, experiencing the love in a limited way. But even though is love, recognize and take a deep breath. And I resound, vibrate high, activating this love that lives in everything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I am the real love. I am the real love. I am the real love. I take a deep breath and I imagine how my own being projects itself towards the inside and the outside. I imagine that inside of me there is a tinier version of myself. smaller version that starts to multiply towards the inside with another one smaller another one even smaller and so on until they disappear in the core of my heart towards the eternity And I imagine now a version of myself bigger than me holding me inside and another one holding us both, expanding another one bigger, inside another one even bigger, multiplying for the entire infinite towards the eternity of the cosmos. I recognize that towards the inside I find every version of what I have been in the past and towards the outside all the versions of who I may become in the future. I am here and now the physical version of myself in this third dimension, in this reality, as all the rest, all the other versions from the past and the future are the ones living in the fourth dimension. I take a look within, recognizing that each one of these versions is even younger, going towards the past, looking into each one of the processes I've been through, even before I was gestated, when I was a spirit, and before in other lives in other worlds and realities, all of them versions of myself, of my own history. Take a deep breath and I take a look to the future, outside, expanded to the cosmos towards the versions of myself that I had yet to become in this life, in other lives, in other worlds, 
in the entire universe. I am all of them, and all of them connect to me through the fractal of my heart. and I resound, connecting them all in harmony, uniting my past, present, and future. I am love in everyone. I am love in everyone. I am love in everyone. I take a deep breath and I see above, below, in front, behind, in both sides, images of myself with different faces, different clothes, different colors coming towards me from all the directions, watching me as I recognize that they are my guides and masters. I see them as the reflections of myself in the fifth dimension smiling at me recognizing that they are guiding me through life I recognize all of these masters I recognize all these kinds.
I allow myself to interact with them, to feel how they touch me, how they share with me their visions of clarity and awareness. I see as I feel all of them, I go deep to my heart and I start to connect them all as one to me through my, through my vibration. I am all of them, I am the unity in this fifth dimension. All the masters lives in me. I am the love in unity. 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 I perceive behind someone 
with its back against my back. I feel its presence, the heat, its energy, and I can recognize that it completes me, even if I cannot see it. It is everything holding me. And I recognize that in order to see its face, I need to project myself in thousands of other faces to be able to see it. I extend my hands and touch the hands of those who I love. those who represent all the good for me in my soul and my spirit, all the people that through love take the best out of me. I see them all holding hands towards the infinite. I see all their faces. I observe all the people that I have loved, I love and I will love. All together around me in these fractals of people, one aside the other and behind the other expanding towards the infinite, around, until they reach the person behind me. I recognize that the love I feel for all these people is a fractalization of the love I feel for the one that is behind me, connected to me. And by loving all of them equally, recognizing, allowing me to feel that love is how, is how I will be able to see the face of this being, which is myself. I feel how I move as the other moves, connecting the spine as one, the backs as one, as one, becoming one in an axis that expands all this love through the universe. And I recognize that it's because of love that I create all these realities. And I set the intention to remember me as that creator.
I am love in expansion. I am love in expansion. I am love in expansion. I take a deep breath. And I recognize myself as the center of my own world. My things, people, stuff, my thoughts, my feelings, my experiences, all of them around me creating a sphere from which I am its core. I recognize that this world around me, my own world, is setting all its pressure upon me. All my beliefs, my mind, my emotions, <clears throat> my life itself, my history, my relationships, my bounds, attachments, projects and future, my intentions, all of it at the same distance. push towards me and I feel the pressure of my entire world all over Take a deep breath. And I start to feel how this pressure creates power, strength, energy. The friction starts to create the heat that turns all my body into the fire that ignites, expanding light. I start to feel how this light becomes in colors. The 12 rays of light shine towards every direction, enlightening my world from within igniting the power of my being. I am light. And it's my light, the one that creates all the things, the one that creates my world. I start to perceive myself blossoming as a flower, a huge and beautiful flower irradiating all these lights, these rays. Recognizing that in each process of death, there is a rebirth that within me 
I have the potential of the eternal love. I am the creator of all things. I am the light. I am the life. I am the love. I remember that I am the potential that gives origin to all my times and spaces that I am my past, present and future and I observe all my life in front of me I try to remember to bring the memories, the images, since the moment I was born, throughout my childhood, teenagehood and adulthood. I perceive that I am close to death. I feel death close to me and I see my entire life passing by in front of my eyes. Take a deep breath in that instant of death. Taking the death in between my hands. In the middle of light and darkness. I let go all my life. I dare drink the death instead of running from it allowing the death to nourish me in my own light turning it into the amber sea into the nectar that made me immortal and by being immortal I expand my eternity. From my eternity, I expand the future without any limits above, around my sides, the present, and under, below, I absorb past. Going back to the core, to the eternity. As I repeat once and again this process, I recognize that it's not anymore only my life that goes in front of my eyes 
not this only life, it's all of them, all around, the past lives, present lives, parallel lives, the future ones, all of them creating the Taurus around me. All the life from every dimension, every timeline, every space, all of it, they expand and contract once and again in the Taurus, coming back to the core, to the eternity. I am the origin of all time and all space. I am the essence of existence. I am the love that enlightens. I am the love that enlightens. I am the love that enlightens. I become aware of all those things that inspire me in my life and that I have been able to manifest them, to integrate them within me and how many other inspirations I wasn't able to manifest. I become fully aware of my breathings in front of each one of these inspirations.
I become fully aware that all these inspirations are the ones that inspire me to be, that inspire the being that I am. And so I recognize that all of them nourish the being that I am, the divinity that I am. And I become aware that as I inspire, I see myself as the own inspiration. I am the inspiration for the whole universe to be. I am the inspiration of all inspirations. I am Eloha Elohim. love that nourish I am the love that nourish I am the love that nourish I believe I am the inspiration. I am God.
I'm at home. Take a deep breath, bringing all this consciousness throughout all your body, throughout all your being, and each one at its own time, come back here and now. <laughs> 